Today we're trying Frizzle's Chicken Farmhouse. I've heard good things about this place. Let's go see if they're true right after that intro. Roll that intro. <laughs> too much further make sure you pause the video click that subscribe button and ring the notification bell so you don't miss any upcoming videos all right like i said before we're trying frizzles here in pigeon forge and what's frizzles known for they're singing chickens i don't know how often it goes off but we got kelly Cluxon right above us they do lunch and breakfast here and they serve until 1 p.m so keep that in mind if you want to come here you got to get here before 1 p.m and here's their menu i think i'm going to get the whole breakfast which i can get like this is sweet gravy eggs and sausage maybe? I don't know. But they have omelets, french toast, chicken and waffles, and stuff like that. So, and then here's their lunch menu. Chicken tenders, obviously. <laughs> Hamburger, ham, stuff like that. Okay, here's like an overview of the chicken. Kelly Cluxon, Cluck Norris, of course. Henry Rogers, Layer Swift instead of Taylor Swift. They do have like merch you could buy here to celebrate your trip to the chickens. <laughs> See the chickens? They're just everywhere. They got them all over the restaurant. <laughs> Pretty cool. All right, here's what we're working with. I got the two eggs of ring easy, hash browns, sausage, and biscuits and gravy. Percy got the chicken and waffles. Lori got the chicken tenders. And Nathan got the bacon and pancakes. We'll let you know how it is. It's happening. They're singing. All right, just ate the breakfast here, Frizzles. Well, breakfast and lunch, because Lauren had the chicken tenders, and I was impressed with the speed and efficiency of this place. The food was pretty good, like, kind of like your average diner fare, but I liked it. The I had the biscuits and gravy, and the gravy almost had like a smoky-ish flavor to it. Might have been the sausage in the gravy, but I don't know. Nathan didn't really like his stuff too much. He got the pancakes and the bacon, but he ate one of Lauren's chicken tenders. Lauren, what'd you think of the chicken? I thought it was good. Um, I really liked the chicken chicken actually and the fries are good too. There you go. What did you think about your uh, chicken and waffles there, Chrissy? It was really good. I enjoyed it. Waffle was nice. I like their syrup. All right. There you go. That's a review of the food here. The chickens did sing once when we were here. And then they made like waffles down here. <laughs> so that was really super cute. It's not like overwhelming with the chickens. So if you're worried that it's going to be annoying with the chickens, it's not. I honestly wish they would do the chickens some more, you know. I would say if you're looking for a good place in Pigeon Forge with a fun environment the kids are sure to love, and I loved it too, then check this place out. It was like $73 for the four of us to eat, so not the cheapest place in town, but I think the atmosphere makes up for it. All right, everyone, we're going to go ahead and wrap this video up here, but make sure you hang out for just a little bit longer because we'll have some end cards with some video suggestions, and we'd love it if you'd watch another video. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe so you don't miss any upcoming videos. Click that join button down there below to find out all the great benefits of becoming a member of the channel. If you got any value out of this video, or if you just want to help keep the show on the road, we have a super thanks button down there. Anyway, you choose to support the channel, we really appreciate it. Say cluck and good time in Pigeon Forge to let me know you made it this far into the video. All right, everyone. We'll catch you in the next video. Thanks a lot for watching. Peace and love.